Right guys, Gaft is back with the explanation to the uh, impromptu any card at any number, so it can be a borrowed shuffle deck. Spectator is going to touch a card. Remember this card for me. Show them, don't look at it. As you turn your hand over, you're going to take the deck, thumb on the one side, fingers on the other, and you're going to let this top portion of the cards fall, covering the out job chosen card. And when you strip off these cards to do the Hindu shuffle, you're going to contact that chosen card, stripping it out first, do the shuffle, their card will end up on the bottom. So you're going to go, touch a card for me. Right, remember this card, the King of Hearts. Turn your hand over, let the top packet go. Contact with their chosen card and that top packet. And you're going to shuffle it to the bottom. You're now just going to shuffle that card back to the top. So their card will be on the top of the deck. But you do need to get one card on top of this. So the easiest way to do that, little pinky pull down on the bottom card, turn it into a thumb break, and then cut that card to the top. So you will have a indifferent card on top of their card. You can now turn the deck over and say, look, your card is not on the bottom and it's not on the top. So you're going to show them the top card. This is not their card. You're now going to get a quick double lift under those two cards so you're going to say look it's not the bottom card it's not the top card get a little double making sure this doesn't flash and move this five forward making sure it all looks squared up but in reality you've got their card hiding underneath so look i'm going to pull out cards from underneath you can call out stop whenever you like so you're going to pull out cards until they call out stop as soon as they call out stop, square the deck and spread it and say, look, you could have had any of these cards, but you stopped me on this one card. And it is the card they chose, the King of Hearts. So that's how you do it, guys. There's just one thing to note. When you turn this over and you get your double and you move this forward, sometimes it is possible when you slide this card out, this card might slide out with it. So make sure that that does not happen. And instead of fanning around, I would just pull out these cards quite quickly. And just when you've got a few cards out, you can make them look a little bit scruffy. So it might hide that card if it does want to slide out a little bit. And as soon as they call out stop, square it up, spread it. The first face down card will be the chosen card. So that's how I did it, guys. Nice and simple, nothing to it. And one thing, God save the king. Cheers.